then he said, and I welcome you to my newest review. It's for the band Aberrant Castigation and their brand new album Thrones of Existent Abandonment. It came out on New Standard Elite Records. First, I want to say some parts for, of the band. Um, the band were, began just with two members, um, Torso from, Bre from Bremen, Germany, um, who, who was writing the whole music and the drum programming, and Al from Alpstadt, South Germany, um, who, was, who was doing and still doing the vocals for the band. They came together uh, like uh, in the end of 2011 and started the four track EP, which came out in the beginning of 2012. Uh, self release through the band and um, shortly after it they signed um, the, the contract for a full length album on NSE Records. This um, label, New Standard Elite Records, is from California uh, and is owned by the drummer of Inner Red Disease. Um, then the writing after the release, uh, the writing process started for um, the new album which came out uh, last week on um, I guess May 1st it was um, the, the, the album was recorded also by um, Torso guitars and, uh, and uh, the arrangements Al did the vocals again drums were uh, recorded from Lille the drummer of Defeated Sanity and the bass sound was recorded by Anton this the bassist of um, the Russian band Flashbomb so, um, for me the album um, it's strong and intense technical death metal, it's not too over technical, um, it's, for me it's just enough to lift it up um, from the raw stuff and the big mass of bands from the genre. Uh, for me it's a mixture between Defeated Sanity, Deeds of Flash, Disgorge and Internal Suffering. Uh, vocally, there are enough changings, not wide changing, wide significant changings. L is using um, the amount of his his range um, in the guttural part he's doing, but he's doing that in a real uh, interesting and um, yeah, real, real good way. Um, what um, brings something good for the songs? The good thing is that um, every time or always when you think the vocals are getting boring there's a, ch there's a change which uh, keeps it really interesting and the, the, the same thing is on the music side uh, always in the songs when you think they are getting boring there is um, some, some um, groove changings, um, some rhythmic changing thrown in or a groovy groovy hook, riff, whatever is thrown in, so keep it always interesting. You, you, the album not, is not getting boring while hearing, um, so it's always kept interesting, what I said before. Um, and this is what I think uh, lift this album up um, in the higher hierarchy of blasting sickness, that to call it, in the salsa fadeaway. Um, uh, this, this music makes a band, uh, this kind of playing, this style makes this band more unique and there's no way they have to hide behind country mates, um, defeated sanity. So yeah, Lille recorded the drums, you can hear it and this and his um, drum sound g gives the album a real old school sound in my opinion like the older Discord records. Um, and the, ba the best I told you was recorded from um, Anton Flashbomb and but all the music was written by Torso and it's really amazing that just one guy um, wrote an, an technical and um, amazing album like that that um, and all the complicity in the songs it just really shows a great musicianship in my opinion and um, now the, um, the lineup was um, completed like they are free now is from Alex from the Neutral Parasitosis now is their permanent drummer and um, I did for, um, the Neutral Parasitosis for the, for, the, for the one track demo I also did a review uh, where I post a link for it so you can see this as well and yeah the, what I also want to say what was a really great thing from the band is they put so much money and work and all in it and so much passion and um, they put it out for free on the internet 
for sure you can get your hard copy version from NSE records and from the state from the band and the merchandise stuff but they really put it just out for free for download I think that's real dedication for the music and that more people can hear it and the real fans will buy the album for sure and appreciate what the band did and so I, I will post the links where you can download it and where you can get your hard copy all in the description you should really really check it out it's an awesome um, brutal death metal album in a technical way and for me it was one of the best albums I've heard this year so I gave 9 points out of 10 because it's really really good give it a try so thanks for watching and see you next time your Danny Z.